All right, are we ready to start this? Is this Taco Bell sound driving anyone crazy? <sighs> Thank you, enemy chaser. All right, are we ready? Are we ready, guys? Are you ready for me to start? Should we go? Boing! 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 All right, bloody hollow fest. I was expecting a terrifying scream when I pressed start game. Please let there be voice acting. Or I'm gonna have to act up a storm. Who is it? It's me, Jeff. You were supposed to be at the camp hours ago. Oh, shit. Sorry, Jeff. I overslept again. I knew it! Todd, did you hear that? Pay up the 20 bucks. I won the bet. You bet that I would oversleep? Relax. You get 50%. By the way, since I knew this would happen, I told Tyler an hour ago to pick you up at the bus stop. You know the one near your house. Well, thanks, Jeff. I better grab my stuff and not keep Tyler waiting. Hey, Todd, hand over the 20 bucks. My favorite style of graphics for a horror game. Right here. Right here, bud. We be walking. All right, first few steps. First few steps are feeling good. Anything in the can? Can't open it. First few steps, feeling good. Slower walking, please. I can run. But I want full immersion here tonight. Full immersion. A Gordita Crunch. Mm, thank you, Dev5000, for the 12 months. Okay. Let's go, people. Here's the bus stop. Any newspaper? I like newspaper in games. It gives you the lore. Bus stop. Cheesy gordita crunch in my stomach. Pleasures. Oh, oh. Yeah! The police are investigating the disappearance of three young women in the last seven days. Three women aged between 20 and 24. Hey, that's like me. Have gone missing this week. A resident in the area claims that on the night of one of the disappearances, he spotted a strange individual lurking around the vicinity of one of their homes. However, due to poor lighting in the area, he could not make a positive identification. The city is bewildered by these events, and authorities have advised residents to avoid going out after dark. Secure doors, windows, and report any suspicious activity to the emergency hotline. Damn, what a scare! What are you doing here alone? Buses don't run this late. Could you get out of my face? Hmm. Has no one taught you to approach people like that? Are you waiting for someone? It's none of your business. I'm waiting for a girl. On second thought, I think I already found her. What are you talking about? I love walking at night. The silence. The city changes completely. He looks like me. There is nothing about this fucking man that looks like me. L Dude, you're nuts! Oh. He's a cool guy, is he? Look at him looking back. He's coming back. Oh, no. Get out of here, fuck boy. 
Oh, he's checking if there's anyone here. Oh, shit. We gotta roll up this newspaper. We need a weapon. No time to read that with the creepy guy hanging around. Bro. Jesus, that was scary. Thank you, Dev. Is this the bus? Finally. that guy I don't know but he gave me the creeps bro there are some really weird people around here come on we'll get in thank you hotspot and here we are one more year what's the plan we got to finish decorating the place with the Halloween stuff and get some of the games ready for tomorrow but don't worry there's plenty of time to get everything sorted out go drop your stuff off at the cabin and meet us in the dining hall Find your cabin and leave the backpack. Fucking Tyler's, am I right? Tyler. Who knows a Tyler in the chat? Am I, you know what I'm talking about? Thank you, Hotspot. Tyler. Any Tyler's in the chat? Because I want a word with you after class. It's dark here. Did Mr. Mr. Maxi Loves is in the chat. Did he get a huge PB last night? All the Tylers I've known have actually been very nice, I think. Well, let, me, let me think. Yeah, they've been nice. They've been nice. Tyler. I've not known a bad Tyler. What's that one name, guy or girl, that you know they're gonna be a pain in your wiener? Before I join the gra- Oh, yeah. Where's my cabin? Thank you, Chef Lucador. Thank you, thank you. Lucas? The fuck are you- That's my name, you pieces of shit! It worries me how many of you said that at the same time. Jessica Mike. Jess in my experience, Jessica's always the stuck up hot chick. Maybe not stuck up. It's just the hot chick. Beyond that, I don't know. Place backpack. Whoa. Jessica, yeah, that that's partially why I name my Steam character Jessica Mac sometimes, because I see Jessica as the hot chick. So when I was creating my fake hot chick on the internet, I thought Jessica, Jessica Angel, it's perfect, and Jessica Mac. Wait, this isn't mine, but I'll go in. Let's see their hobbies. What is this? A bunch of passports? Olga? I know one Olga. And she's from Metal Gear Solid 2. That guy is going fucking in! Holy! Now this is a party. Who the hell is that? This is a party! T 
Todd. Fuck you, Todd. Beth is the life of the party. This encap encapsulates going to a bar with your new college friends. You always have these four kinds of people. The insane... The insane one that's usually on drugs. The party guy. The guy trying to fit in. And then me! This isn't World of Warcraft. Where's my drink? No, you finally arrived! Come on, I have something to show you! She's got quite the skeeter, if you know what I'm saying. Holy shit, how's she walking forward? She's gonna fall backwards! Thank you, Elastic. Uh, glad to hear it. Look at the yacht on that. You have got to be kidding me right now with these game devs these days. Why are we? How's life in the new city? Did you get the job you wanted? Yeah, though it turned out to be crap. Like every job I've had so far. Sometimes, I think I should have stayed in the town and continued with my family business. Maya, working at her parents' bar for her whole life? No way. You've always been a rebel, but also the smartest among us. You just have to keep trying. You'll get what you're looking for in the end. You think so? I'm sure. What? What do you think? Wow, this is what you had to show me? Yep, I'm wearing it tonight. <gasps> Who's the lucky one? Jeff. You're dating Jeff? Shh, the others don't know yet. I don't want us to be in the subject of their jokes tonight. Wow, just wow. Since when? Not long, just a week. Despite being a joker and seeming like a jerk at times, he's a romantic. Maya Beth, let's all gather by the fire. Join us! Oh, I forgot he uh, didn't read the name. Ready for our annual horror story session? I guess so. Let's go. Let's go, baby! Whoa. So this is everyone? This sucks ass. Where, where are all the people? All right, everyone's here. Dude, this is like nightmare scenario for me, personally. I, like, well, no. If you're not like really, 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 really good friends with at least one of these people, this is bad and I hate this. All right, everyone's here. I've always hated situations where you're with a group, but you're not really good friends with a single person in that group. And you also don't have a ton in common with a single person in that group. It just feels like shit. But if you have like one person you're really, really good friends with, and then one person like, like, like you're decent friends with, then it's amazing. Then like the other two people, or the other three people, that they could just blend in. You, and you can just feed off your friends, but man. All right, everyone's here. Sure y'all heard about the counselor who lost his life in this very camp 20 years ago. His name was Derek. It all started as a prank by the other counselors on a night like this. Also during the preparations for the Halloween party. The counselors thought it would be fun to play a prank on Derek, but first they had to spook him. So they all gathered by the fire to tell a horror story just like we're doing right now. One of the counselors told the story of the pumpkin killer. The pumpkin killer? Yeah, it's an old legend. My grandpa told me about it when I was a kid. 
Many years ago in the town they found a witch and burned her alive. But before she died, the witch said that every year at midnight, right at the beginning of October 31st, her spirit would return to seek revenge on everyone. It's said that the curse brings back a serial killer who can't be hurt or killed. His head is covered by a pumpkin and no one has ever seen his face. After finishing the story, one of the girls started screaming, pointing towards the trees. And there he was, the pumpkin killer, holding a bloody ax. Everyone started screaming and running, but the killer was only after Derek, who ran to his cabin and locked himself in. One of the counselors cut the power, and then everyone surrounded the cabin, banging on the walls. Leave me alone! I haven't done anything! Derek shouted from inside the cabin. You could also hear him crying. Then everything fell silent as Nejodli resubbed to the channel. After a few seconds, Derek's friends started laughing and shouting, It's a prank, Derek! You can come out! We're sorry! But Derek didn't answer or open the cabin door. Faced with the silence, the counselors started to worry, so they turned the power back on. One of the guys entered through one of the windows to find out what was happening. Derek was dead. The one who pretended to be the pumpkin killer was one of Derek's roommates. It seemed that while he was picking out the axe for the prank, he left the others lying on the ground. Due to panic and darkness, Derek tripped and fell headfirst into the only axe whose edge was pointing upward. His friends found him in a pool of blood with his head split in half. Then... <laughs> Damn, Tyler. Not funny. It's hilarious. <laughs> All right, enough of the stories. We need to get to work. My, there are still some decorations left to put up. Can you place some pumpkins at the entrance? I think there are still some in the lake cabin. Sure. Look for pumpkins, candles inside in in the lake side cabin. <laughs> the lake side cabin. Ugh. All right, where's the lake? Tyler, I'm glad you're with us again this year. Shut up, Tyler. Todd. I like the beer in his hand. No, I'm not going to PAX East. I wish. Are there two people making hooky over there? Okay, fellas, get a room. Not bad. We got a show tonight. Not bad at all.
You two should head to your cabin. Oh shit, we've been busted. Relax, Maya knows. What, you told her? She's a good friend, she won't say anything. I'm a tomb. Come on, Jeff. You and I have something pending. Oh, could you do me a favor? What do you need? Jeff and I are supposed to go pick up the Halloween pinata and hang it on the gallows. Can you take care of it? I guess so. Where is it stored? In the workshop near the forbidden area. You mean the old workshop? Yeah, they haven't started building the new one yet. Okay, I see. I'll handle the pinata once I'm done placing the pumpkins. All right, we got another mission. I'll take it. Thank you, lightly loaded nachos. Thank you so much. I want some nachos now. Salt, pepper, red onion, tomato, parsley, green onion, cheddar, gruyere, Munster cheese, broiler, Thank you, Laura Dukes. Where the hell are we putting these? Just around? Place the pumpkins at the entrance. Okay. How does American plastic cheese make me feel? Um, I've always hated it actually. It's it's sort of vile. Worst cheese ever. You talk you're talking craft singles, right? <laughs> I need to go find a lighter. I wonder how many days of your life you lose at for every craft single. Like think of it, you know that movie with Justin Timberlake, I think it is. And he has to, he have, you have to scan your, like, your time left on Earth to, like, do everything, to eat, sleep, whatever. I feel like every craft single, you're just, you're just expiring, like, a day later, or earlier. Tyler, do you have a lighter? I left it with Tyler, go on the side. Alright, what happened to his voice? <laughs> That grilled cheese hit though. Let me tell you something. A grilled cheese is going to hit way harder if you get real cheese. Man, the lowest. But you know, it is comfort food though. That's the, that's the, that's the bad thing. Like, if you grow up eating like, or not like shit, if you grow up low income, um, and you have things like craft singles, craft dinner, you know, the works, then like 20 years later, it just becomes like a comfort meal. Like nothing beats it, you know? Do you have Tyler's lighter? I need to light some pumpkins. I left it on one of the tables, but return it when you're done. Thank you, Astro. Thank you, Gatsu. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Craft singles are expensive as fuck? No way. It's the cheapest cheese in the world, isn't it? You can buy like a pack of a hundred for like 50 cents. I wonder what the, what the ingredients are in craft singles. I've never looked.
Look, I'm drinking out of a craft single right now. Get it, guys? Look, should I eat the craft single? Because it's made of plastic. Oh! 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 Whoa! Whoa! La a uh, freaking go 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 it's done time to get the pinata but first i have to return tyler's later let's go let's go think it's mostly vegetable oil probably most cheap things are mostly vegetable oil havarti's good for grilled cheese brie brie cheese and poached pears And roasted garlic. Here's the lighter, thanks. Banner to the to the workshop, to the workshop, to the to the workshop. Brie cheese on sourdough bread with some honey and basil. God tier. Brie cheese with any just brie cheese in general. Some some foods like the starter You just after the starter you can't go like brie cheese and bread whatever the fuck you add after that It doesn't matter like it's gonna be really good. You know what I mean? It's just so good together that any addition like obviously you don't dump like don't take a shit on it, but you know anything after that Thank you Ed Hawkins and Captain Mad Bush Thank you Did I scare you guys? <clears throat> Wait, do we need something in here? Oh, that's the pinata. God. The generator is working fine. You got me. Almost choked on my sandwich. Jesus Christ, I gotta be careful. Second degree murder. Thank you, Diet Fish. <laughs> Done. I think there's nothing more to do. I'll go see if they need any help in the dining hall. Thank you, Mem Fizz. Thank you. Oh no. Are they pranking? <sighs> Todd, don't start hitting on me. Grab a beer and join the party. Here it comes. This is what you call a party? Where's Tyler? He said he was looking for you at the workshop. Thought he got lost. What's wrong with the lights? Do you know if the generator has fuel? What's wrong? I activated it this afternoon, but I forgot to check the fuel level. Oh, Todd! At least we have the pumpkins. Yeah, pumpkins. What do we do now? Someone has to go to the generator. Here, take Tyler's lighter. Don't you plan on coming with me, bro? Who, me? No way! I'm not going out in the dark to the generator. Oh, come on! What's that smell? Oh, I think you crapped yourself and you should change your pants or you'll attract the flies around here. Haha, <laughs> look at me laughing. You poopied your pants. I'd rather be dead than be in this situation. And you can take out all the horror as well. Thought you got love. When to look for you? What happened to the lights? T 
Todd forgot to check the fuel level of the generator. Typical. By the way, where is he? He stayed in the dining hall. He's too scared. You can literally fucking see him, Tyler. Use your goddamn eyes. No one's hit on me yet. This is unrealistic. Where's Where's Jeff and Beth? Busy. Busy? I think they're still with the decorations. Games for tomorrow and all that. Ah, I thought, well, we were done. Apparently not. All right. Gas in the where? The grayest man on Twitch. Hello? Where? Oh! You made my shirt all wrinkly. Great. Tyler, are you okay? Tyler? Crap, what's happening? Thank you, girls. Thank you for the 85, sir. We're coming, Tyler. Thank you, Memphis. Thank you, Diet Fish. Let's take a look off the dock real quick. All right. You guys ruined my shirt. Great. It wouldn't let me over here. Thank you, Geo. Wait, okay, so he yelled and I can't go check on him. I'm confused, fellas. Let me. No, my shirt's not wrinkled anymore. Where are those two lovebirds? I want to hear some magic. If you can walk in on them. Has anyone ever walked in on that? Where are they? All 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 the time? What? You live in a brothel or something? 
Yep, on your parents. Yikes. That's not a fun one. Alright, I'm legitimately stuck. Thank you, Exo. Thank you, Kevin. A am I is there supposed to be an invisible wall here? Like, I see a new handprint, but I can't go over there. Yo, thank you, Pan Pandorosa. Yo, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm glad to hear that. Thank you. Appreciate your generosity. My dad walked into the hallway once naked. It was pretty rough. There's some things you gotta sacrifice when you have kids. And walking around the house naked is one of them, I think. Guys, I, I don't think the game is working. I don't think there should be an invisible wall here. Right? Am I crazy to think that? Or am I stupid? Well, yeah, I can't talk to him. Yeah, I work I ruined a perfectly working game. Yeah, see I can't talk to Todd. So so the game was like Dev here, you have to talk to the guy. No, that's not a Miggy, not a dev. All right. Oop. I hope it saves. Uh oh. Guys, it didn't save. Guys, speed run. Don't worry, it'll take three minutes. It'll take it'll take less time than it would have taken if I sat there and tried to do something. I got a wedgie. Oh, yeah! Ah! <clears throat> oh, thank you, Ponderosa. Yo, dynamite. Any fresh skeeter today? Sure. Do -do 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 -do. Yo, med unit. Alright, get out of here, you fuckboy. Steve Harvey, yeah. It's a white Steve Harvey. Thank you, FX. Dr. Phil. Yeah, it's Dr. Phil. Oh! Yo, Ghost Rider. 
Thank you, Wired Vex, for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. Thank you, th th thank you. <gasps> oh. Th 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 thank you. Th 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 thank you. Enjoy, everybody. Enjoy the ad free viewing. The emotes. The Discord. I'm gonna break it just from going fast. Oh, this is the worst part of the run. You have to wait for Beth's slow ass. Well, thank you, Vex. I appreciate it. Get going! You have got to be kidding me! <laughs> See, Bozo got the joke. This game is very speed runnable. I think I have issues. I couldn't get to sleep last night, so I put on the Dead Space playlist I did. Somehow seek help. Yeah, seek help. Seek help. I don't know how some of you sleep to my streams. Boo! <sighs> I, this is the hardest part. Got a reset. By the way, if you're just getting here, the game broke and I had to restart it and we had to start from the beginning. So I'm just sprinting back to where you were. Thank you, Dumpster Drew, for the tier two. Th -th 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 thank you. Th -th 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 thank you. It's done. Time to get the pinata. Return the lighter to Todd. Yeah, just another day of me trying to pretend like I haven't played it before. Oh my god, you guys. Let's hang this guy up. Ow. 
And we're we're almost back. We're almost back. Tyler, can you hear me? Yeah, what's up? The generator is broken. What do you mean? Someone cut the cables. Are you sure? Maybe a rat chewed on them. The cuts are clean. It couldn't have been a rat. Wait, I'm coming to see. All right, we didn't even do this part. Oh. Because I ran over that way first, and then he screamed, and I couldn't get back here. It did bug. Is that blood? Tyler! I hope this isn't one of your pranks or you're dead! Better go back to camp. We had to inspect the handprint. I see him. Did they hang another pinata? Uh, Todd! Who could have done something like this? And with the bolt cutters, too! I have to find the others. Look for Beth in the cabin. What cabin? Beth! What's going on? I'm busy. We need to call the police. Someone's murdered Todd! And Tyler's missing! It's not a joke. I'm telling you. Todd is dead. Someone killed him! Whatever you say, now I have to get back inside. I can see what I was doing. Jeff, you okay? Uh-oh. Jeff's got it. Todd, I'm sorry. Oh shit, oh shit. Beth! I'm here. Beth, I need you to react. It's a screwdriver. Well, I know. Where's the phone? Oh. The phone isn't working. Someone cut the line! What about the phone in your cabin? I don't think it's a good idea. Whoever did this is supposed to have destroyed all the phones. They don't want anyone leaving. What the hell do we do? The cars! The damn cars! Where are the keys? I don't know, Tyler. Store them somewhere. I'm not sure of anything. I'll go check. She dead. Fucking bastard!
music's really good. Where could Tyler have put the keys? No keys. Oh shit! Keys? Keys! Seems like he's gone. Where the hell are those damn keys? Think, man. Maybe across cross the lake with one of those canoes. Should we go for the canoes, fellas? I'm taking the window back out, or not. All right, this isn't a good idea. Do you guys think it's all a prank? Or is there the is the pumpkin killer on the loose? Do 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 do. Even though people are dead, nothing will kill this funky beat. Thank you, Balam Gardens. Thank you. <coughs> Get that man some green herb. Agreed. All right, let's go to the canoe. I'm sure everything will be fine. Everything will be fine. Someone broke the canoes. They're gone. Fuck. Tyler! Tyler, you're alive! Are you okay? Someone attacked me. I left the workshop and I managed to escape. I think I, I, I got cuts all over my body. Where are the others? They're all dead. Beth, Jeff, Todd. This is a nightmare. Where are the canoes? I don't know. I ran here to get one across the lake, but they weren't here. Damn it. We have to find a way out of this place. The camp gate's locked. The car keys are missing and the phones don't work. And the canoes are gone. How are we supposed to get out of here? Swim? The lake is too big to swim across. We'd freeze or drown before making it. Exactly. We have no way to escape. We're both going to die. But there has to be some way. Of course. Why didn't I think of it before? The Forbidden Zone! What's there that can help us? Have you ever heard the story of the tunnel? The tunnel? What tunnel? When I was a kid, my father told me that children from the camp start disappearing, but later they'd reappear. This went on for several days. One day a counselor secretly followed them and discovered the kids had found an old tunnel hidden in the ground. Apparently the tunnel led to the other side of the road. And do you know how to get to this tunnel, Tyler? <laughs> I only know it's in the Forbidden Zone, under one of the cabins, but I don't even know if the tunnel really exists! We don't have many other options. We should go. Fine, let's get going. I hope you know how to get there. I can barely find the workshop. Tyler is hella sus right now. Guys, whatever happens to me... Let my final words be that don't trust Tyler. Yeah, I don't trust that waddle. Huh. What was that? Hello, is someone there? Shut up, idiot. What if it's the killer and he hears us? The killer? We better hurry. Let's go. Holy Tyler! He's like, wait, I'm the killer. Fuck. Forgot it was psychotic. Oh, yeah, we get the Taco Bell sounds again. Cheesy Gordita Crunch. Crunch Trap Supreme. Meow, meow, meow. Where did Tyler go? Don't go into the long grass! Tyler! Tyler!
Yeah. That's... Dude. Psychos think like that. Wait, I forgot I was psychotic. Tyler? Tyler, you in there? Taco Bell. Tyler? Guys, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell, um, press the like button. Uh, Uh, um, Taco Bell? Hit that Taco Bell. Today marks one year since Jack's death. We all miss him and feel guilty, especially me. I'll never forgive myself for suggesting that prank. Maybe I should have told the police instead of claiming it was an accident. I can't stop having nightmares since it happened. So I'm 1969, by the way. Nice. Sometimes I think I shouldn't come back to this camp anymore. The longer I stay here, the worse the nightmares get. Tomorrow, I'm going to suggest moving it near the lake. I'm sure the others will agree with me. Today, I talked to the rest of the group about relocating the camp near the lake. Everyone thought it was a fantastic idea. So in September, we'll start preparing the ground and building the new cabins. This morning, my wife came to visit, and I got a pleasant surprise when I saw she brought Bea with her. What? They're gonna stay around for a couple days. I'm sure both of them will have a great time. Uh-oh. Today, Wayne tried to blow his head off. No one, <laughs> no one knew he brought a gun to camp. Spencer had been warning us for days that Wayne's behavior was strange, claiming he seemed depressed. So he's been keeping an eye on him. This afternoon, he saw Wayne wander a bit away from camp and followed him without noticing. When he got far enough, Wayne pulled out the revolver and he was lucky Spencer followed him. Thanks to him, he's still alive. We all gathered to talk to him, to help him, but he needs more than our help. He's also broken by Jack's death, feeling almost as guilty as I do, almost. Almost as guilty as I do. A few minutes ago, the guys and I decided to close the camp and not reopen it until we move it near the lake. I think it'll be good for all of us to leave this place for a while. I've stored the revolver in the safe in my cabin and notified the police to pick it up. I told them I left the combination written on the laminated card inside the well bucket. Where's that well bucket? And where's the safe, too? Well, there's the safe. Now, where's the bell? Sorry, I had to yawn. Um. Alright, I'm gonna close the door that the safe is- Holy shit, that scared me. And nothing even happened, I just thought I heard something. Jeez! Okay, am I hearing shit? Thank you, nice guy. P -p 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 Peck that subscribe button. I agree. Guys, think of it as a mini game. The more times you press that button, like if it was a mobile game, you'd see like all of a sudden a gold chain would appear upon me. Then I'd get some grills. Then my hat would turn into like platinum. And then I'll have all these wristwatches and, and bracelets.
Like at the end of Luigi's Mansion or Wario World. Sure! I knew it! 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 I knew it. Okay, I'm gonna take it for two loops so I have enough time. Wait, he he lost me. Cheesy Looks max. Same clothes as Tyler? Hmm. Yammers! Guys, it's my birthday tomorrow. How old do you wish I was turning? How old do you wish I was turning? Twenty-one. 18 75 90 <sighs> 69 I'm imagine me at 69 Oh At 69 I'll be the perfect specimen Hello? 6422 Can I use the revolver? Today marks 20 years since your death. I've been living all this time with a strong hatred in my heart. But finally, the day has come to let it all out. To avenge those who took you away from me and mom. I do this to honor your memory and mom's. She took her own life shortly after you left. Now those who still survive will feel what I felt when I snatched the lives of their children. Their lives will be left in darkness, just like mine was extinguished. With love, Tyler, you'll always be in my heart. Surprise, Tyler! I see you're at a loss for words. Did you know it was your father who ended my father's life? I've been waiting for this day for years, and it's finally here. They'll finally feel what I've felt all these years, and my father can rest in peace. You're sick! I'm so sick that I'll chop you into pieces with this axe and send you home to your parents in a box. I'll love to see the look on their faces when they see what's inside. You're insane, you damn psycho. I'm a psycho? Your father started all this. My mother took her life after my father's death. I became an orphan, uh, orphan and I'm the psychopath. You've murdered your friends. They weren't guilty of anything. Of course not. It's not personal against you guys, but against your parents. I hope we get to continue this time. Surprise! He can truck it. He can fucking take it. Imagine shooting a guy and the only response is.
Do 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 brittle floor. The part of the floor seems more fragile than the rest. <laughs> Tunnel entrance. <whistles> Oops, I meant to go woo-hoo, but I whistled it for some reason. I don't like that. I get I'm getting granny or I'm getting nun massacre vibes. If you guys can't see, I am holding a lighter like nun massacre. Did I get anyone? Did anyone shitted their pants? Always left. Well, we can't go left anymore. But we can go this left. Where's the nun? Where do you think you're going? You won't be able to get out of here without a key. I have it in my pocket. Turn! Guys, I, let, let it be known that I went all left every time I could and we got here. this. I fucking hate this. Oh! <laughs> Shit! So I'm just gonna hope he doesn't come up behind me then. Thank you, Vatican. See, it'd be easy if you could just bait him like this and walk backwards, but the fact that he can come from anywhere is just like... Fuck. Okay, I'll just walk. I'll walk. I'll walk. It's my fault for running. Cheesy gordita crunch. Cheesy gordita. All right, let's wait. Let's wait. Let's wait. Let's wait. Let's wait. Ah! At least the music's a banger. Thank you, DB. Ah. Fuck, I can't. 
I need a dead end. Stat! Where are the dead ends? Dude. I think you just have to shoot him. He's coming. This is like, this is too hard. Not that we won't get it. I'm just saying like, it's like, it's sort of absurd. You know what I mean? Thank you, Cracker. Thank you, Chicken God. Thank you, James. Thank you, Antis. Th 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 thank you. All right, I think we just gotta run a certain like distance. After he runs away, we have to travel a certain distance. I think think then it activates his AI. So we're just gonna have to run until we reach like a, a dead end, and then wait there. And the dead end can't be at the corner of a fucking hallway. So now let's go back to where we were before. I can't find it. Fuck! Ah! The gun... Okay, here's the thing. You can't seize it. The gun has a cooldown. Look, I'll shoot it as fast as possible. Like that, that cooldown could be the, the difference between life and death. Boing, 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 boing. Uh oh, this is not a good place because he's. Follow the arrows. You. No, you have to kill him.
Boing, oing, 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 oing. I think you must. I mean, the mission objective is to take the keys off his body. But maybe you do have to run. If so, the game isn't very uh, good about it. to move. I didn't run far enough. Walking for about 10 minutes. It's gonna be the guy from the freaking bus stop that picks me up. And the the game's the game's message will be fuck you. Life sucks. Oh my god, come on, get in the car. I know the area, thank you. Yeah, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for it, the lights to turn on and it's that fucking dude with the mustache and the glasses. Where's the car, jump scare? classic ones we have to look away and then look back oh sir you passed it you just missed the intersection hey I'm talking to you Thank you, Harambe is my homie. Thank you, Wesker Sandwich. That was a good game. That was fun. I like that little game. <gasps> yeah, that was a good game. That's a, that's a thumbs up. See? See this? I'm gonna shove this up the game's ass. Yeah, she should still have the gun, so it's a happy ending. She killed him. Then got charged with first-degree murder because it's Canada. And now she's in jail for life.